In today's video, I'm gonna try to rewrite history in every Super Bowl, starting with the one in the 2000 season. Between the Ravens and the Giants, Baltimore won 34 to seven. So we're gonna try to win as New York in this one. Huge thanks to DraftKings for sponsoring today's video. Football season is officially here and you know what that means. Fantasy football punishments, but not this year. I'm getting in on the action with DraftKings and saving myself from embarrassment. This month, I've teamed up with DraftKings Kings to let you guys know about an awesome deal they have going on right now. New customers who sign up using promo code BIRDSNEST and make a minimum deposit of $5 or more will get $25 in a bonus bet plus $25 in casino credits. You heard it right. Now you can get in on the action with DraftKings Sportsbook and DraftKings Casino. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook and Casino app, deposit $5 or more and get $25 in a bonus bet and $25 in casino credits when you sign up with promo code birds nest so gear up for game day with DraftKings. whether it's taking the under or taking a spin on touchdown roulette DraftKings has got you covered most importantly DraftKings is safe secure and reliable they have a variety of ways for you to have fun including touchdown blackjack and football blackjack so what are you waiting for go ahead and deposit five dollars or more and get 25 dollars in a bonus bet and $25 in casino credits. Huge thanks once again to DraftKings for sponsoring today's video. So we begin in Madden 01. We're gonna be on five minutes in all Madden. Injuries are gonna be turned off, fatigue will still be on, but I'm only doing five minutes because there's no super sim in these earlier Maddens. So yeah, I gotta play the entire game. Bruh. Quick look at the Ravens. You have a 96 Ray Lewis, Boware, McCrary, Ogden, Shannon Sharp, Rod Woodson, Ben Coates at tight end, so many studs on his team. Banks is leading the way at quarterback, but the Giants have a pretty decent roster too. Strahan, Armstead, Seahorn, as their top three but those are the only guys in the 90s on the entire roster Kerry Collins leading the way gonna need him to go crazy first down and 10 they're gonna go to the toss good tackle right there from Seahorn Banks gonna drop back how did he complete that there's no way and they're down inside the five man I don't know how in the world we did not get that pick they get the touchdown Priest Holmes puts them up and we get our first first down of the video Amani Toomer on a slant that's who I'm looking for okay Amani somehow catching that in traffic will take it got the first down by the skin of our teeth as we begin the second quarter Ron Dane oh getting a nice block on the outside Ron Dane with a nice run this man is a power back he should be able to get in there it is tie game look at the big boy oh. celebrate third and ten for the Ravens let's go beautiful tackle we forced a punt so good start third and six hit the hurry up going to Imani again this time he fumbles the football Bye. they scoop it up Bow we're off to the races we can't stop him from scoring and the ravens take the lead they're only down one possession in the fourth quarter oh Amani Toomer with a nice route. Great catch. Collins is killing it right now. Another laser. Alfred off to the races. Shaking off tackles. Third down and goal. Looks like zone. I'm tempted to run this football, but I'm not going to do it. Here we go. L1. Hilliard. Touchdown. They're going to go for the field goal. I don't blame him. Does he have the leg? Yes. And the accuracy. Matt Stover with a 55 yarder to put the Ravens on top. Fourth and 22. Let's just see if we can uh, get a Hail Mary, uh, you know, a miracle catch. Otherwise, it's looking like it's over. Oh, Amani Toomer. Wait a minute. Wait. Oh, he had it and dropped it. So we start off 0-1. Could not get the dub for the Giants. But at least it was a lot closer than the original Super Bowl. Collins started turning up in the second half couldn't get the run game going that ravens defense is insane let's go to the next super bowl though and try our luck in that one next up we're in mad no two looking at the 2001 season where the patriots beat the rams in the super bowl 20 to 17 in super bowl 36 lawyer malloy is their only 90 plus overall on the team bledsoe was an 86 overall remember this is when brady who's not even listed in their top three quarterbacks took over for bledsoe and 
won the Super Bowl. So we don't have to deal with him just yet in this video. We got lucky. Meanwhile, the Rams have a 99 overall Marshall Falk, 97 overall Orlando Pace, 95 Warner, 93 Isaac Bruce, 90 Aeneas Williams. So that's four more 90 overalls than the Patriots. I mean, they're looking good on paper. I just got to do my best to not sell. Going to be a pass. Bledsoe surveying the field. Pass, Finding Troy Brown for the first. Pull back in motion. I'm going to shoot the gap if it's a run. Oh, it's a run. Come on. Oh, Redmond gets the touchdown. Good drive. First drive did not go as planned. Let's see if we can establish this running game. Get Marshall Falk going. There we go. Dragon folks getting the first down. What a run. Uh-oh. Marshall Falk with some great blocks on the outside. Biggest run of the game. Sending Bruce deep. Same with Ricky Pro. There it is. Ricky Pro off to the races. What a dot. Touchdown. We have a tie game. Less than two minutes left. Kurt Warner. We need a game winning drive right here. Need someone to step up. Anyone. Oh, Ricky Pro. He's open. Warner gets rid of it. Another one. What a catch. Keeping the drive alive, man. What a play. First and goal inside the 10. We're going back to Marshall. See if he can make up for that earlier drop. Going to him again. That was not a great run. Let's see if this one's better. Yes, sir. Marshall Falk giving the Rams the lead. One stop and we win this game. One timeout for the Patriots remaining. 53 seconds. Let's see if we can get this W. Bledsoe going to have to take off fumble. There it is! We have successfully rewritten history in Super Bowl 36. Got the Rams the W. Kurt Warner with a nasty drive. Marshall Falk with the touchdown. Ricky Pro with a catch on that final drive to help us win. We're one and one. We are now in Madden 03. Looking at the 2002 season where the Buccaneers beat the Raiders 48 to 21 in Super Bowl 37. Tampa Bay has a 99 overall Warren Sapp. Eric Brooks, John Lynch, Keyshawn Johnson, Rondé, Gramatica. I mean, this team was absolutely stacked. Brad Johnson leading the way at QB. But we're going to be using Charles Woodson in the Raiders. Him and Rod Woodson in the secondary. Lincoln Kennedy on the O-line. Janikowski, Rich Gannon at quarterback, throwing to Tim Brown. Jerry Rice is wide receiver too. I got to go to him and Brown as much as possible. Second down and four. Oh yeah, that's an interception. Fight. Come on. No way, McCardell with the mall. Yes, sir. Coverage sack coming up. Okay, we'll take it. Incomplete pass. Way to stop him on third down. <laughs> Boom. Oh, my goodness. You can it with the speed. Off to the races. Getting across midfield. What a return. After that amazing kick return, we got to go for it. Fourth down and 10. Oh, Williams with the catch, but he can't get the first. I'm doing my best, but this Bucks defense is no joke. We are trying. There it is. Tim Brown first down. Let's go. There it is. Tim Brown coming back for his quarterback. We take the lead for the first time in the game. Third down and eight. Johnson dropping back. Gonna throw it in the coverage. Not sure about that decision. We force another punt. Let's see if we can get some points on this drive. Garner wide open out of the backfield. Getting the first down and then some. Big third down and 10. We get this first. We have a chance to bleed some more clock. Oh, nobody's open. Actually, Tim Brown. Oh my goodness, Gannon with a dot. We're down inside the five. Gotta go to the quarterback sneak. Gannon dies, but can't get it. Fight. Wait, wait a minute. They let him score the touchdown. We'll take it. Grammatica gonna attempt the onside kick. We recover it. Tim Brown is a Super Bowl champion. Let's go. Here we go in Madden 04. Looking at a 2003 season when the New England Patriots beat the Carolina Panthers 32 to 29 in Super Bowl 38. This time, we have to deal with a 99 Vinatieri, a bunch of 90-plus overalls, and then, of course, Tom Brady at quarterback this time. Could not avoid him for too long. Panthers have a few 90-plus overalls. Sauerbrunn, Jenkins, Julius Peppers. Their roster is looking pretty solid at quarterback. We have Jake DeLome and Rodney Pete. Not sure who we're going to start just yet, but they do have the advantage. Luckily, we have Steven Davis, 87 overall, Musin Muhammad, a young Steve Smith, but it's going to be our defense that's going to help us get this w if we're going to come out on top gotta at least get three right here safety's creeping up let's go magnum once again this time he's still on his feet inside the 30 third and goal inside the five i don't want brady to have any time on the clock let's see if we can punch this bad boy in davis gets the touchdown and we take the lead heading into half number two look at this dude oh no we throw a pick jake delome throwing a pick six and the patriots take the lead just 
like that. We're down four with four seconds left. Gotta go to the Hail Mary. Last chance to win this bad boy. Oh my God, we caught the ball, but unfortunately, there's no more time. We could not rewrite history in this Super Bowl. My bad, Carolina. On to Madden 05. Looking at the 2004 season when the Patriots beat my Eagles 24 to 21 in Super Bowl 39. Time to change that outcome. This time, Brady's up to a 95 and they have four players with a higher overall than him. So it's gonna be a very tough battle. But the Eagles have 98 overall weapon next. 97 overall Torrell Owens, Akers, and McNabb. Not to mention a bunch of other 90 plus overalls. The roster is looking really good, man. I think we have a good chance. Gonna get ball first in this one. Hopefully we can set the tone with a very nice drive. McNabb on his first pass. Freddie Mitchell getting us down inside the 35. I'm just gonna take off of McNabb. We're gonna take off for the first down. McNabb inside the five. What a run. It's third and goal at the one. Westbrook can't get there. Richard Seymour with the penetration. We have to settle for the three. What a stop by him. Defense looking pretty solid so far. Have a chance to get a three and now on Brady. Oh, he's going deep to the left side. Dawkins with the nice breakup. <laughs> Wait till you see. No, we fumbled the football. I try to spin away from the defender. Look at Westbrook with the hustle, but they still take the lead. That's on me. I should have went for the fair catch. 16 seconds left before halftime. Can we somehow get some points up? There's no way. There's just no way. I know I got rid of it. Oh, another fumble. What is going on? Of course they get the touchdown. They're not going to review it either, man. Just a terrible couple of plays is the reason why we're down multiple possessions heading into halftime. I'm going deep right here. Second and nine. Give T.O. a another chance at greatness he catches that one somehow now it's a third down let's see if we can keep the chains moving taking off of McNabb taking off diving for the touchdown one possession game last chance fourth down and 30 gotta just throw it up and give Owens a chance at greatness he has a step Terrell Owens can't get the catch and we could not go ahead and rewrite history even though the Eagles outplayed the Patriots had way more yards way more first downs just too many giveaways and now we're two and three in the video so far. We are on to Madden 06, looking at the 2005 season when the Steelers beat the Seahawks 21 to 10 in Super Bowl 40. Alan Feneca, hopefully I said that right, is their highest overall player. Joey Porter, Casey Hampton, Heinz freaking Ward, Palomalu Farrier. I mean, the Steelers were stacked. Deuce Staley, Big Ben, the bus. So many playmakers on this team, gonna be very tough to stop them. But the Seahawks. Seahawks have Walter Jones, Sean Alexander, Steve Hutchinson. O-line is disgusting. You have Hasselbeck at quarterback leading the way. Pretty solid secondary as well. This should be a close matchup. Hopefully we can come out on top. Oh, he's going deep. Holy one-on-one -on -one coverage. Heinz Ward with the first touchdown of the game. Not the start we wanted. Looks like they're stacking a box. Oh, L1 wide open. Yes, sir. Pathin. Hopefully I said that right. Is going to answer back. With a long touchdown of his own. We were able to get a stop on defense. Now we're back with the football and a chance to take the lead. Going to the tall Sean Alexander. Getting a nice gain. Might be a little crazy, but I'm going to keep the ball in the hands of our best offensive player. Sean Alexander. We're going to run it again to counter. They can't stop him. Alexander going to give us the lead. What a drive. Uh oh, Max Strong off to the races. Huge run by the fullback. Worst case scenario, we got to stay in field goal range. Oh my goodness, this dude is unbelievable. That was not even me that hit the spin right there. He did it on his own, and now we're up two possessions. Oh, let's go! Interception by our linebacker. Everything's going our way right now. I'm gonna go for it on fourth and goal. There it is! Three possession lead, our biggest of the video. We successfully rewrite history in this Super Bowl. Thanks to Sean Alexander, 133 rushing yards. We are now three and three on the video. Yo. Next up is Madden 07. Looking at the 2006 season when the Indianapolis Colts beat the Chicago Bears 29 to 17 in Super Bowl 41. Somehow we're going to have to beat a 99 overall Peyton Manning with a bunch of other 90 plus overalls on his team, including two 90 plus overall wide receivers to throw to an 87 overall Dallas Clark at tight 
man. Their defense is insane. The Bears do have 298 overalls. Olin Krutz. Hopefully I said that right. And Brian Erlacher. And then a few other guys in the 90 club as well. Rex Grossman going to be leading the way at quarterback. Thomas Jones. Cedric Benson. Pretty solid running back core. Adrian Peterson. Not the one you're thinking of. Devin Hester. 98 speed. I'm going to try to get some return touchdowns with him. That would be nice. But uh, yeah, this is going to be an uphill battle. Hopefully we can stop Peyton in this offense. First play of the game. Going to be a handoff. Great tackle. Chance to get a three and out. Slow down this Colts offense. Peyton with some audibles. Always a scary sight. User and Erlacher. Watch in the middle of the field. Let's go. Oh, that should have been picked off. We'll take the three and out though. Third down and seven. Trying to keep the chains moving. X wide open. Yes, sir. Grossman putting it on the money. Uh-oh. Jones getting the touchdown. First points of the game. Bears are on top. We enter the fourth quarter with a four point lead. 17-13. Trying to hold on to it. Oh, triangle. Nice catch. Gage gets us into their territory. Yes, sir. Oh, right in his hands. He drops it. Would have been a touchdown. Instead, we got to settle for the three third and forever less than four minutes in the game we get this stop we will be looking good Peyton going to Harrison but it's short of the sticks and he fumbles I think the fumble is gonna get overturned Erlacher takes it to the house but I'm pretty sure he was down never mind they're not gonna challenge and we go up two possessions just like that third down if we get this first game is all but over our tight end has been balling all game so you know we had to go right back to him Rex Grossman outplaying Peyton Manning a lot of the dirty work was done by thomas jones on the ground it kept harrison and wayne in check defense absolutely killed it man we were able to rewrite history in this one four and three on the video so far on to madden 08 looking at the 2007 season when the new york giants upset the new england patriots in the super bowl 17 to 14 jeremy shockey is the giants highest overall player 95 overall then you have strahan and pierce at 94 a bunch of other guys in in the 90s plaxco being one of them eli at an 85 overall gonna lead the way remember this is a giants team that had a filthy defensive line but also some really solid players on offense jacobs at running back gonna be tough to bring down burris and tumor at wide receiver and shockey at tight end that's a nasty offense but the patriots have tom brady the goat not to mention seymour asante adelius thomas randy freaking moss i'm pretty sure this is the year where he set the touchdown record so we have all the weapons we need to make it happen here comes a third and short up the gut nowhere to go so the defense escapes without giving up any points on the first drive but let's just be honest this is a passing team because of tom brady and of course randy moss any one-on-one -on -one situations i'm going to randy first down now they don't have gronk just yet which is crazy how they still had one of the best offenses ever brady gonna dump it off to stallworth who gets the first let's go brady to brady off to the races inside the 30 we go this is a no-brainer we're going deep to randy one-on-one -on -one coverage one-handed moss that's what he does first points of the game here comes eli very next possession we get the user alert why are these quarterbacks testing me man let's go play action moss coming across the field he's open brady finds him we're inside the 10. Moss is going to truck somebody. And that's his second touchdown of the game. Third and five. This is a crucial play for Eli and the Giants. Another interception. Mike Vrabel with the INT. This one's getting ugly. Dominant performance by the Patriots. 17 to nothing. We successfully rewrite history in this Super Bowl. We are now in Madden 09. Looking at the 2008 season. When the Pittsburgh Steelers beat the Arizona cardinals 27 to 23 in super bowl 43 troy palomalu leading the way at a 98 overall big ben's a 95 willie parker 93 so many 90 plus overalls on this team heinz ward as well santonio holmes a lot of talent another very tough opponent but my goal is to get larry legend of super bowl and i'm gonna do my best okay he's a 97 overall him and anquan both 95 plus overall you have 
have Adrian Wilson, 96 overall. Edrin James at running back. Kurt Warner at quarterback. They have the huge overall advantage, 94 to 78. So we go into this game as heavy underdogs. A three and out to start the game would be absolutely amazing. Here we go. Trying to get to the quarterback. Big Ben dumping it off. Spath can't get the first down. The way to get off the field. Here we go. First time on offense. Oh, we just get rid of it. Edgerin James fighting for the first down. Palomalo creeping up again. This time it's one-on-one -on -one coverage. I'm going deep. Larry Legend against the quarterback and he catches it touchdown Arizona first lead of the game Big Ben gets hit as he throws it another one as we get the INT it's Gerald oh I'm looking for him there it is Werner off his back foot somehow completes that oh what a route by Edger and James freeing himself up against the linebacker we're down inside the 20 X wide open Warner with the dot Pope gets lit up but he holds on for the first down going to the right side away from Palomalu getting a nice block Edger in trying to get to the edge and he does two possession lead less than two minutes left in the game we're up 14 Steelers are moving though they're across midfield and they're still running the football not sure about that play call they're forced to use a timeout fourth down and two if we get a stop we win this and we successfully rewrite history willie parker can't get it make that four maddens in a row where we successfully rewrote history kurt warner edgerin james larry legend is now a super bowl champion we are now six and three on the video on to madden 10 looking at the 2009 season when the new orleans saints beat the indianapolis colts 31 to 17 in Super Bowl 44. 96 overall. Breeze leading away for New Orleans. But only two other 90 plus overalls. They're both on his offensive line. So he will probably be dotting us up all over the field. Vilma, Darren Sharper. They have some studs on defense. Reggie Bush at running back. Malcolm Jenkins. But we have a 99 overall sheriff known as Peyton Manning. And more 90 plus overalls than the Saints do. So we should have the edge going into this game. Reggie Wayne. 95 overall, Bob Sanders, Freeney, Jeff Saturday, Dallas Clark, Mathis. I mean, this team is pretty stacked as well. You have Vinatieri at kicker. He knows how to win Super Bowls. Gonna start this game on defense. Gotta set the tone early. Let Breeze know this is not gonna be an easy walk in the park, okay? Bush with his first carry the game. Second down and one. Breeze surveying the field. Going over the middle. Green gonna get the first points of the game. Too easy. Little play action. Never hurt nobody. Gotta get rid of it a die out the backfield getting the first down there it is reggie wayne first catch of the game getting us across midfield dallas clark joining the action picking up the first down now we just have to punch it in get this touchdown joseph a die scoring the touchdown tying this bad boy up last drive was way too easy for breeze gotta make him work for it oh that should have been picked off obviously i'm glad it wasn't a completion but you gotta take your opportunities when you're going up against a quarterback this good breeze in the shot Gun. This time we pick it off. Hayden with the INT. That's what I'm talking about. Here we go. Great field position. Have to capitalize. Reggie Wayne wide open. Getting a nice block from Dallas Clark. Inside the 10 we go. Uh oh, Joseph Adai to the outside. Colts take the lead. Nothing open. Oh, that's a nice laser. Oh no. Oh no. Breeze has just tied it right back up. But they got caught out of position. Reggie Wayne looks like he's in one-on-one -on -one coverage. I might have to send him deep. Oh, there's the blitz. Manning off his back foot finds Reggie Wayne, who's having a monster half. Oh, Dallas Clark this time with a nice release, getting us inside the 30. A die on the carry, first and goal. And they give us the touchdown. We take the lead right before halftime. You gotta assume it's four down territory for Breeze in this offense. Moore once again over the middle, and they're gonna give him the touchdown. We have a tie game. All we have to do is get in field goal range. We have a minute and 48 seconds, still have all three timeouts. Out. and Peyton Manning leading away Dallas Clark with the first catch of the drive oh what a laser by Peyton Manning over the middle to Gonzalez Vinatieri has a bunch of game winners under his belt and we're gonna add to the list with this one make that five Super Bowls in a row where we rewrote history Breeze and company got off to a great start but Peyton was not to be denied we are now seven and three in the video when it comes to rewriting history like the video if you're enjoying it greatly help 
helps the channel also hit that subscribe button if you haven't already we are now in madden 11 looking at the 2010 season when the green bay packers beat the pittsburgh steelers 31 to 25 in super bowl 45 charles woodson leading the way for green bay you have aaron Rodgers, of course 94 overall collins and jennings the only other 90 plus overalls on the roster but you have elite talent at wide receiver for Rodgers to throw to meanwhile palomalu leading the way with debo james harrison 97 overall for both of them then a few other 90 plus overalls big ben heinz ward that wide receiver quarterback duo is hopefully gonna be enough for us to get the w in this game Rodgers' first drop back of the game oh that should have been a pick madden already selling us we played that perfectly but they did not give us the interception now it's second and 10 ryan grant gonna get a huge gain and a first down i'd be happy with giving up only three on this drive here we go rogers finding a wide open jennings good drive from green bay not the best start at all okay we're struggling there it is yes heinz ward finally getting us in a field goal range best play of the day so far for this offense now can we get seven on the board oh yeah perfect pass from big ben to heinz ward touchdown pittsburgh Big hit fumble, let's go! Scoop and score from Sanders. Just like that, we have the lead. Boom, big hit by Ryan Clark. Another fumble, Taylor recovers it. Heinz Ward, off a nice pass from Big Ben, gets us inside the 10. It's been nothing but big plays for number 86. Having himself a monstrous game. Halfback stretch, Mendenhall extends our lead. Third down situation, chance to get off the field and possibly seal this game right here, right now. Rodgers going down. That could be the game. They're gonna punt the football, so we just need a couple first downs and it's all but over we're gonna take the three 100 power great accuracy two possession lead last chance for the packers fourth and eight in their own territory no more timeouts rogers in the shotgun surveying the field incomplete pass pittsburgh our super bowl champions this time we successfully rewrite history again make that six super bowls in a row eight and three so far in the video we are now in madden 12 look at the 2011 season when the giants beat the patriots again 21 to 17 this time in super bowl 46 chris knee the highest overall player on the g-men this time they have justin tuck and a few other guys in the 90 plus club eli's up to an 87 bradshaw at running back but i'll be honest they should be the underdogs heading into this one because new england has a 99 overall brady and four other guys in a 90 plus club secondary defense in general is looking absolutely amazing gronk is on the team this time he's an 84 overall this was a young rob gronkowski you have hernandez as well woodhead ben jarvis at running back wes welker 90 overall with a young edelman let's see if we can keep the rewrite streak going first defensive drive we got the giants in a third and forever chance to get off the field and set the tone early eli going to the screen but will Ford gets the sack obviously the one big difference is they don't have randy moss from that 2017 but uh yeah now they have gronk so i mean hey still have some nasty weapons and then gronk on a go route there he is wide open gronkowski nice catch second and 10 maybe the last play before the two minute warning hernandez in a game two tight end set play action he's wide open aaron hernandez first points of the game eli three-step drop going over the middle that's a laser to hakeem nicks nice pass and he throws a pick a couple plays later right to my user so now we have a chance to extend our lead right before halftime Gronk with another nice catch how did he hold on to that gonna attempt this 50 yarder with Steven Goskowski 10-0 ball game another user pick Gerard Mayo with the icing on the cake and there it is seven Super Bowls in a row we were able to rewrite history still have a bunch left but we're nine and three in the video so far next up we're in Madden 13 looking at the 2010 
2012 season when the Baltimore Ravens beat the Niners 34-31 in Super Bowl 47. Ravens looking stacked, of course. Hello, Dinata, Ed Reed, 97 overall. Ray Lewis, T. Sizzle, Ray Rice, Flacco at quarterback. Gonna be a very, very tough team to beat. Bolden at wide receiver. This is one of the most well-rounded teams we've seen in the video so far. But the Niners have a 98 overall Patrick Willis with a 98 Justin Smith, Vernon Davis at tight end, a bunch of other 90 plus overalls. We're trying to get Frank Gore, his first Super Bowl win. If we rely on him and the defense, I think we have a good chance. Randy Moss, we're trying to get him a ring. Alex Smith at quarterback. This should be a good one. Oh, wow. Flacco going deep already. Intercepted. Rodgers rising up. Off to a great start. Vernon Davis in 101 getting a nice catch. We're down inside the 25. Looking at Walker through the seams. Vernon Davis taking a break. Manningham with the nice spin move. R1 wide open. Frank Gore going to get us the first points of the game. Willis chasing down the pass catcher. Forcing a fumble. We scoop it up and take the two possession lead. That's why he's one of the best MOBs of his generation. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Frank Gore on the screen. Off to the races. Ginormous play. Uh-oh. Stop and go. Frank Gore back to back. Big plays. Now we got them thinking run. We're going to go to the play action. Look at the safeties creeping up. Randy Moss. No! We try to force it to him. And Webb gets the INT. I should have kept running the football. Oh, another one. This time it's the D-line that forces the fumble. The big boy Smith scoops and scores. And the Niners are Super Bowl champions in this one eight straight super bowls we were able to rewrite history we're 10 and 3 in this video so far randy moss is a super bowl champion same with frank gore and patrick willis so for the 2013 season all the way to the 2019 season i already tried to rewrite history in two separate videos i'm gonna link them in the description once again those ones are from madden 25 all the way up to madden 20 if you want to check it out go ahead but now we're gonna go all the way to madden 20 and look at the 2020 season so now we are on to super bowl 55 in madden 21 looking at that 2020 season when the buccaneers beat the chiefs 31 to 9 in the super bowl brady leading away at quarterback only two other guys in the 90 plus club on this buccaneers team but they have phenomenal depth remember gronk antonio brown Kong su jpp a lot of very good veterans on this roster but the chiefs have Mahomes and Kelsey, not to mention Tyreek, the Honey Badger, Schwartz, Chris Jones. They're very top heavy. They dealt with a lot of injuries leading up to that Super Bowl. If you remember, the O-line was not 100% healthy, so I expect this one to be a lot closer. Third down and 11. Uh-oh. Brady throwing an interception. He got hit as he threw it. We're going to start with great field position on our first offensive drive. Third and six. Looking for Tyreek. Oh, yeah. No, he's not open. X is open, though. He drops it. Going to have to settle for the three chance to get two straight three and outs would be a phenomenal start for this defense they're going to the screen incomplete there it is get Tyreek the football as much as possible start a quarter number two third and six up three right at midfield oh x there it is kelsey showing the other tight ends how to catch touchdown here would be absolutely huge it's gonna be man coverage circle wide open just taking what the defense gives us miko gets down to the 10 and i'll try to find a way to punch this into the end zone Nicole getting us down to the three but we're gonna have to settle for the three hopefully the lack of touchdowns early on does not come back to haunt us later in the game in case you're wondering too because I've sometimes some people always say you know that I'm not actually on all Madden but as you can see all Madden sim we're just playing lights out right now hopefully it continues another interception he was going for Gronk but Thornhill gets his second INT of the half I'm going deep to Tyreek it looks like they're setting the blitz I gotta throw it up up. give Tyreek a chance there it is we're down inside the 25 what a dot gonna put me Cole on the street looks like he has a free release and that should be an easy touchdown two possession lead fast forward to the fourth quarter second and ten three turnovers for the Buccaneers we're still up seven and all we need to do is run out the clock third and ten I'm looking at Kelsey through the seams they let him get a free release and that's too easy another Super Bowl in which we rewrite history nine straight and a 11 and 3 in the entire video.
video with only two Super Bowls remaining. On to Madden 22. Looking at the 2021 season when the Los Angeles Rams beat the Cincinnati Bengals 23 to 20 in Super Bowl 56. Ramsey, Donald, and Cooper Cup. Not to mention Von Miller. This team was stacked. At the top, you have Odell, Whitworth, Johnny Hecker. I mean, just a lot of talent. Stafford, of course, at quarterback. Mixon was the highest overall. Bengal, him and Bates, the only 90 plus overalls. Burrow was an 86. Jamar Chase was a rookie, but they still had a ton of talent and they should be able to put up a good fight in this one. It would be very good to start out with a three and out. Third and three. Nice block shed by Hubbard. So now we have a chance to get the first points of the game, but Donald and Vaughn, that's a scary duo on the D-line. I'm not going to lie to you. Oh God. Gonna have to take off with Burrow. They're forcing me to run. Mason can do damage as well. We're going to try to run away from Donald as much as possible. Mixing off to the races. Burrow stepping up. Nowhere to go with it. He's going to take off. Burrow has speed. Nothing but green in front of him. We're down inside the five. Phenomenal drive going on, but we have to cap it off with a touchdown or I'm not going to be satisfied. Mixon does the honors. Oh, Cooper Cup off to the races on the jet sweep. It was only a matter of time before he made a big play. Third and eight. Chance to hold them to three points. Good tackle in the open field by Hilton. Two minute warning has been reached. Mixon to the outside, getting us inside the 15. Third and six, chance to get a two possession lead if we can score a touchdown. Burrow on the run, nowhere to go. Donald's right there. Gotta settle for the three. You gotta think it's four down territory. So we need four more stops as a defense and we should be able to win this game. Aker's gonna get the touchdown. We have a tie game. Time to get a game winning drive with Joe Burr. Three minutes, 42 seconds. Still have all three timeouts. Mixon starting us off with a nice gain on the ground. So we end up settling for three. Not the most ideal outcome, but we did take all of their timeouts. So Stafford's going to have to find a way to get in field goal range without being able to stop the clock. 38 seconds left. Watching Odell and Cooper Cup, of course. They're going to dump it off short. Not sure about that decision. Clock continues to tick. 20 seconds left. They're running the football. What is with this decision making? I'm not mad at it because obviously it helps our chances of winning but still it would have been a way better finish wait a minute odell catching the football but he's out of bounds no time left even if he was in bounds we rewrite history once again 12 and 3 in the video now with one madden and one super bowl remaining and finally madden 23 looking at the 2022 season when the kansas city chiefs beat my philadelphia eagles 38 35 in super bowl 57 kansas city he comes into this matchup without Tyreek, obviously, but they still have a phenomenal roster. Mahomes and Kelsey leading the way. Kadarius, who they got midseason. Meanwhile, the Eagles, of course, have a really good old line led by Kelsey and Johnson. Brown, Slay, Reddit, Goddard. I mean, this team is looking really good. Hurts leading the way. I updated the rosters as much as possible, so Miles Jack is on the team. Same with DeAndre Swift. Gonna spotlight Kelsey. Make sure anyone else beats us, just not him. Oh! we get the user alert on Patrick Mahomes on the first drive. Coach wants me to go for it, but I got to play smart. Let's take the three. Had to get some points off the turnover. Getting zero right there would have been a travesty. There it is. We lurked them again. Nolan Smith off to the races. Two picks on two straight drives. Third and nine. Got to find a way to keep the chains moving. Dallas Goddard going to do the honors. We're down inside the one. You already know. Quarterback sneak right up the gut. Jalen gives us the two possession lead i feel the need to pause it and show you again that we are indeed on all madden man gonna go to options you can see it for yourself just doing really well i, I don't know what's going on why these offenses are struggling so much but i'm glad they are man I i'm loving it it's really fun rewriting history but right there mahomes gets a nice dot third and ten they're in field goal range trying to hold them to three let's see if we can do it damn it we let kelsey get open but blankenship with a nice play Big third down right here. Gonna use Swift to block. Looking for AJ Brown on his comeback. There it is. Oh, he went out of bounds. Damn it. I feel like we should be up more after such a good start on defense. But offense not doing them any favors right now. Chiefs have all the momentum right now. Gotta put a stop to it. Tony gets them another first. They have such a good connection going. Second and one. Empty backfield for the Chiefs. Less than 40 seconds left. They're going to Kelsey. Tie game. 21 seconds. Two timeouts left before halftime. Oh my goodness. 
this. This is a nightmarish second quarter. They get the fumble. Somehow we're going to be losing this game after such a good start on defense. Good news is we have the ball to begin half number two. Bad news is they have all the momentum. Chris Jones with the block shed. That's exactly how I feel right now, Jalen. Just nothing is going our way. Gotta find a way to make something happen. Second and 12. I gotta go to my playmakers. AJ Brown. It's time to get him the football and let him be great. Third down and long. Need to find a way to get this first. I'm looking at AJ on a comeback again. This time he gets the tiptoe catch and we keep the chains moving. Third and four. Not in field goal range just yet. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer. Quez. Nice route. First down Philadelphia. We have reached the fourth quarter. Tying this bad boy up with Jake Elliott. This one's coming down to the wire and our streak is at stake. Have to get off the field right here on this third and five. Give our offense another chance. Mahomes dropping back to pass. I'm watching Kelsey. Yes, sir. No, how did he get open? Now they're down inside the 15. Let's go. Good penetration by Cox <laughs> to get the tackle for a loss. Holding them to three. Jalen in the offense are going to have one more chance to tie or take the lead. Here we go. First and 10. Smitty wide open. Easy first down. I'm putting Brown on a corner route. Hopefully he can get open against man coverage. Oh, that's great coverage. Brown still catches it. What a play. We're getting closer and closer to field goal range. AJ Brown, however, has different ideas. Touchdown Eagles. We take the lead. Four point game. Less than 10 seconds left. This is probably the last play of the game. Hail Mary for the Chiefs. Mahomes gonna lob it up to Kelsey, but it doesn't matter. We end up 13 and three in this video when it comes to rewriting history in Super Bowls. If you watched all the way to the end, I just want to say a huge thank you. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. If you did, please destroy the like button if you haven't already. Let me know what other ideas you have for me in the comment section. And until next time.